Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new, my name is Mercedes. I am filming back to back, so you are getting me in the same version. Um, but today I'll be filming my Black Friday haul. I know it's super late, but that's okay. I know a lot of people want to see what I purchased for Black Friday. Um, and I actually, like I've been hoarding it to the side so you all can see as well. So the first purchase I made is from Island P. I purchased their polish Christmas cookie. Um, the intent was to wear this for Christmas time, but I did not get to it. Um, but I've seen it on a couple of people and I was really intrigued and I really wanted to try it. I didn't pick up any other polishes from them. I had self-control, but I love, I love the dainty little red and green glitters. I think, um, it makes such a statement in like that white base. The second thing that I picked up from Island P, I bought it in a duo, is their new base and top coat. Um, if you know me, you know that I love my glistening glow top coat. Um, I always experiment and I always try other top coats, but I always go back to glistening glow. Um, but I still love experimenting. I still love trying new things. So I did want to try their top coat just because it's new. Why not? Right. And I paint my nails so many times, like I know I'll go through it. Um, and their base coat. So I'm always looking for a good base coat that is like sticky or bonding. Um, I just think especially for work, um, and just in general and like at home, I'm a busy person, work, I'm a nurse, um, sanitizer, I wash my hands. So it's just, I, I, I'm always on the hunt for something that says that it's gonna make my polish adhere and last longer. So I'm really excited to try this out. I'm actually gonna leave it out and use it for my next manicure, even though I'm not working in the next few days, but that's okay. I can still give it a try and see how it works for like my daily life. My second, um, my second purchase for the Black Friday was from the website Polish. Now, I don't have a lot of polishes from them and I actually don't shop from them very often unless it's like a polish pickup or I may see a video for a haul and I really like the polishes that were shown. I only really have a handful, but I purchased three. The first one is mm, Revillian. Revillian. It's this gorgeous pink polish with that like shifts from it's just from like that purple wow i can't even talk guys this is definitely not purple it shifts from that beautiful pink shade to like an orangey burnt orangey shade and it has holographic flakes um it's it's really really pretty and it's not like like i'm not a big pink person i know i've mentioned that before um but it's it's more of a, like a deeper pink tone and i can see myself rocking this I can actually just looking at it, the hollow flakes, are those purple flakes too? I don't know, but it's beautiful. Second polish I picked up um, is Calcifer. I love vampy shades. Of course it has holographic flakes. That's what initially drew me into it and the color itself. So this is a gorgeous like reddish tone, kind of a brown tone as well. And it has a gorgeous shift to like a, kind of like almost a brown, goldeny yellow it's beautiful i kind of see a little bit of purple in there too like along the lines here and the last shade that i picked up from polish is mistle right mistle <laughs> um, another beautiful shade this actually would have been gorgeous for christmas time i actually wore a polish recently from polish let me grab it this one is countdown to christmas so i wore this one recently but you can see that they are not the same countdown to christmas is definitely more of a true green um and then mistle is more of a like kelly-ish foresty green so both different initially looking at this one i'm like oh my god i bought the same polish but it's not it's gorgeous and you can see look at that red orange shift beautiful my third purchase was from Polished for Days. I love Polished for Days. Their, their formula never disappoints. It never disappoints. Um, so the first one is Cranberry Fig. Oh my goodness, these flakes are stunning. There's just 
a whole bunch. So you have blue flakies. So you have like these shifting flakes. There's like a blue to purple. There's a yellow to green in that beautiful, gorgeous, like cranberry like base. I can't wait to get this one on my nails. Next one I picked up, still in the box, is Emerald Bobble. And this one is a gorgeous deep green and it has those gold flakes in there. It's beautiful. And the third one I picked up is called Incandescent. And this kind of reminds me of the cranberry fig, right? Because the, ty the, the type of flakies that, that they have. Um, this one almost looks like the shards of flakies because the flakes have like a daggered point to them. But you see there's like orange and red and green and like aqua. It's beautiful. Beautiful. I love Polish for Days flakies. They do such an amazing job. The next set of items aren't actually Polish, but I will show them to you because why not? Um, I purchased the Living Proof um, dry shampoo. Now, I've heard a lot about dry shampoo and the bad chemicals. I think they were saying they were causing cancer, um, but Living Proof had come out with like, some video or some some content, I think it was their Instagram or Facebook, I'm not, I can't really remember, saying that whatever chemical that all of these dry shampoo companies put in their dry shampoo that, that, they, that is causing the cancer or causing what we don't want, um, that they do not put it in theirs. So I have extremely fine hair and my roots get extremely oily after literally, like I can style blow dry, the whole shabam next day my hair will be oily and limp um, so I need something to vamp it up make it look clean without having to wash my hair every single day um, so I've already used it. I purchased two because they had it they had a sale going on um, I purchased two I've already used it um, and I love it I think it does an, a fantastic job my hair says my hair stays like clean um, throughout the day so it's something I'm definitely gonna continue to repurchase. The next set, the next set of items are hair clips. Um, there's this shop that I absolutely love called Shop Andy. Um, I've purchased from her lots of times before this. I love her watch bands and I love her hair clips. Um, she also had, sorry, you can probably hear the crumpling. She also had a Black Friday sale, so I took advantage and I purchased a few of her hair clips. This first one, and she makes some beautiful ones. This first one is just kind of like a claw clip. You just stick it, and like I said, I have fine hair, so if you have thicker hair, this this will not hold your entire head of hair, <laughs> maybe like half of it, if that. But this, if I wrap up my hair, it will hold. It will hold my hair. <laughs> Um, but it's it's gorgeous. It just it makes a statement. My hair is much darker So it is going to pop off of my My hair color, which is what I like the next one is this other type of clip um, Where you just you know, you probably just do a bun or a twist really quickly and just stick it in I don't know what these are called. I don't know um, But I thought it was cute again. I'll definitely Hold my hair. I wouldn't say the entire day. I'd probably have some hair like foliage. My hair would probably get loose throughout the day, but nothing that you can't just like readjust. And then I purchased these little clippies again for like a half up, half down um, look. They're so cute. And the last little clip that I purchased um, is this little seashell. It's so cute. This is perfect for like summertime, going to the beach. Again, this, I mean, this is not going to hold all of my hair. My hair is fine, but it's not that fine. Um, but it's cute for like this little like twist and clip. And the last item that I purchased from Black Friday is from the brand JVN. Um, and this is a pre-wash scalp oil. One of, my, one of my goals for this year, actually probably towards the end of last year into this year, is to really strengthen my hair. Um, and to promote more hair growth. I've always had very fine hair. Um, I don't feel or think that my hair is falling out, but after having kids, I don't know if it's just hormones, probably, um, I just feel like it's not the same texture and it feels just a little more fine. Um, 
So I really want to try and get it back to its previous state, if it can even be at its previous state. Um, and if not, like it is what it is, I'm okay with it. But I, but I really want to do things to help improve the health of my hair if I can help it. Um, so I've tried this maybe like, I don't know, twice already. So I can't really give you a review on it. Um, I do plan on using it a little bit more often and not, I mean, it says here that I can leave it on 15 minutes before washing my hair, but uh, I'm going to use it overnight. So I'd put it on my hair overnight, um, let it do its thing and wash it out in the morning time. So, and then they also, along with that little oil, sent me these little samples. I think they're just like, yeah, it's like a shampoo and like a deep conditioner mask. So this is nice. I'll probably give this a try just because why not, right? So their shampoo and their deep conditioner. You can always use a, a deep conditioner and I love to try different shampoos. And the last purchase for my Black Friday um, are from this brand Vita. Um, I've used this brand before. Uh, I'd say probably almost five years ago um, and I can't really remember I can't really remember the results honestly I was pregnant at the time and it probably wasn't the best I, I wouldn't give you the best review obviously when you're pregnant your hair is completely different um, so I'm just it was good enough for me to repurchase let's just say that so I got the shampoo and conditioner they had a sale going on as well um, I heard about this brand through somebody I watch from YouTube who I've actually watched for years, Rosita Applebaum. Um, I'll leave her information down below, but I've been watching her for years um, and anything that she recommends, I always try and absolutely love. So I trust her. Um, and like I said, one of my goals, like the end of last year into this year is to really take care of my hair and add the nutrients back into it to hopefully get it back to a more a more healthier state um, and a more stronger state as you know i was blonde before and that required bleach so i did have some damage and actually i still do have damage it's just you can't really see it because my hair is darker so um i love using that shampoo i've used it a handful of times actually probably more than that already every time that i use it my hair is so shiny it is less frizzy i can tell a difference as for growth i still need to continue to use it to give you a full review on that so if you're interested let me know maybe i can post some results on instagram i haven't taken any pictures which i probably should um but i'm not good with like the before and after i have way too many pictures stored on my phone so to like find those before pictures are just it's not gonna be good but i know if my hair changes and i can let you guys know that too but yeah that is all i have for my black friday haul um i think i did very well um i wanted to buy a whole crop ton of stuff but i didn't <laughs> um so yes i hope you enjoyed it let me know if you have any questions um, and i'll see you guys in my next one and there is my little one ending the video just in time. <laughs> Bye guys.